Hi everyone, welcome to BISP trainings. My name is Faiza Adam. In this session, uh, we'll be knowing about the report snapshot uh, that comes, uh, that is uh, there in our NetSuite dashboard. Before that, uh, we'll have a small uh, introduction of uh, report snapshot. So, a report snapshot is a report that contains layout information and query results for a specific period or uh, some, you know, specified uh, point of time that we want to show. So if we talk about the NetSuite, so NetSuite includes a large number of uh, standard reports that can be run to obtain the detailed information about the business. In order to have an immediate uh, access to report summary data, we can add a report snapshot portlet to our dashboard that we'll be doing today. So moving on to the NetSuite application. Uh, here, uh, this is my dashboard and where here we can set the report snapshot for that uh, we'll go into personalize option. Here you can see that uh, currently I have uh, 10 reports snapshot. I will simply drag and drop it here. Now how can we uh, set, uh, okay, let me show, uh, set it here. Yes. So uh, for uh, setting up a report snapshot on our dashboard, usually there are uh, two kinds of uh, reports that uh, report snapshots that are there. First is the standard ones and the other are the custom ones. So uh, these, uh, if we go into these three dots and set up, and if I go into the drop down of this, so here you can see these are the various various reports that are available and these are all the standards. It means that uh, they have, it has already been created. We can take this uh, uh, for our reports also. And if we do not want to take these standard ones, so we can uh, create our own custom uh, report snapshot and we can add it on our dashboard. So for this uh, demo purpose, I have created a, a custom ones. This is the one. So this is my custom uh, um, report that, has, that is named as items order, uh, ordered snapshot. Date range, we can change the date, date range like here we have these options like this month to date, this rolling half, this rolling year, this week, this year. So if I take here, this year and here you can see that under the display type uh, either we want to display this report as a list view or in a graphical format so if we uh, take the list option so we have we have to mention uh, the uh, record types how many record types do we want to display in our reports and if I select graph here so you can see for graph, we have these options like chart theme and how many items do we want to display on our report and on which order uh, do we want to display it. So under order by, I will be taking here this quantity sold and I want it to be uh, for, as a sorting as descending. So it's under the chart theme, we have these options like whether, whether uh, we want to uh, take the global theme basic colorful bold light what uh, color theme do we want to match so these are the uh, chart themes this is the custom series color so from which we can select the desired color this is the background type like what kind of background do we want whether we want lines bands or grids so i will be taking here this global background And the G default chart type is uh, that is here is line, bar, column, and pie. These are the options that are available of which I will be taking column. Now I will click save. So here you can see that the report snapshot has been saved. These are the, all the items uh, that are uh, appearing on this uh, x-axis and these are the quantities as we have, you know, uh, selected the uh, 
series as quantity sold if we go into setup here so here we can see that uh, here we have selected the quantity sold so it is appearing while hovering on it we can have like you know uh, for uh, monitor 0065 we have uh, 501 quantity sold for this cisco re110w wireless uh, we have 110 quantities along with that there are uh, various other options you can see the, this uh, arrow this is for maximizing or zooming our report we can zoom it out we can refresh it along with that if i click on these three dots so we can uh, make edit uh, under ma make edit of this uh, snapshot and if i click on this view report so it will take us to the uh, report option i will click on it so here you can see that this is the report uh, that i have created these are the items that have been uh, taken up and this is for subsidy as you know the subsidy is already selected as america and the period is here this year this fiscal year we have selected that is why the dates are here so this is the order by item uh, report if i uh, click on this uh, 1124 laptop t49 so it will give us the uh, details uh, relating to this particular item you can see that it will give us the detailed view of it we'll go back to summary and uh, the other thing that i want to tell is uh, we can create custom records from the existing uh, reports also or we can create a new report from scratch also so whenever uh, we get into like uh, let me show you reports saved reports if i take any of the report here Like if I take this order by customer by class and I click on customize. So we can make required customization in it and uh, I save it for our, uh, for, you know, for visualization on our report snapshot. So we have viewed the report the other options that we have is we can print the chart we can download it into these formats like for png image jpg pdf or svg or also we can if we want to remove it so we can remove it from our dashboard with the help of this remove option we can refresh it other options that we have is we can change the you know uh, layout uh, of our uh, report if we want to have it into the line chart so here it is this is for the bar graph and right now we are on the column ones and if we want to have uh, this report snapshot uh, in the form of pie chart so we can do that also so if i hover over it so it will you know uh, give us the percentage of the uh, quantity sold you can see that this is for laptop t49 this is for leo hybrid 4.8 percent this is for cordless drill this is for Cisco RV 110W wireless and this is for monitor 0065 this is the highest one quantity sold for monitor 0065 so in this way we can have our uh, report snapshot and we can customize uh, it as per our requirement so this is all about the topic in case of any questions and doubts you can reach out to us at www.bispsolutions.com thank you